This is our first view of the ship that will carry us on our Antarctic expedition. It is the MV Ushuaia. Now this video is going to be a compilation of all of our excursions, whether they were land-based or cruise. And we will do a, a more in-depth for each one of them later on. Once we got on board, there was a, a nice reception. And now we're looking at back at Ushuaia. Now we're sailing out into the Beagle Channel, and this is our last view of Argentina before we get back. So our first thing we had to encounter on this trip was the Drake Passage. And I'm trying to hold the camera level-ish, so you can kind of see just how much the ship was swaying. I won't say it was calm, but it was not as bad as I had thought. Well, there was a point one night where I think water was splashing up over the bow because uh, you could really feel the ship moving. Kim said, let's put the suitcase out and see what happens when the ship rocks. Well, there you go. Each excursion, we would load up in the Zodiac and go. Our first stop was Hydrorga Rocks. What we were seeing were the chin strap penguins. These were very cool little penguins. In fact, they didn't seem very scared of us. However, if you watch, this penguin keeps coming towards me, but usually at around 10 or so feet, it'll stop and it'll look and it'll plot away around you. In the afternoon, we went into Patagonia Bay. I actually love this. If you look at it, you'll see the surface is covered with little, they call them pancakes of ice. Essentially, I think this froze over, but the wave action broke the ice up into these little pancakes. And it was cool just to watch the waves go up and down. They almost looked relatively smooth when you looked out a little bit further. This is our first view of really, or close-up view really, of icebergs. And we did go into the bay. But you'll see the video coming up here, and it was, well, here we go. The snow was coming down so hard that it would just start sticking on the lens, so there was not a lot of useful video from this cruise. Plunau Island was our next stop, and this is where we got to see the Gent 2 penguins, first time we saw them. A little bit different in their coloring, and their beaks were red instead of black. But it was, it was nice to see them with the snow coming down. I mean, the snow was really coming down hard. And here you can see everyone set up around the penguins, uh, just taking pictures and videos. This stop was Prospect Point. For about two years in the 1950s, it was a research station for the UK. Beautiful icebergs on the way in, nice ice, and this was our first step on the actual continent of Antarctica. Everything else had been an island up until till this point. This was our first sighting of humpback whales. This was our first sighting of killer whales or orcas. This humpback whale, really there were two of them, came right up beside the ship. They really were not more than maybe 20, 30 feet off of our ship. It was just beautiful. We stopped at Peterman Island. And again, we got to see some more Gen 2 penguins. Kerrville Island was another stop to see some more Gen 2 penguins. Some beautiful scenery as we were cruising on our way back up towards the northern part of the peninsula. A 
I'm not going to lie, I chickened out on the polar plunge. It was the 10 minute Zodiac ride back in a wet bathing suit that really did it for me. On the beach though, there were a couple Gen 2 penguins taking it all in, looking at those people going, look, we can handle the cold. I'm not sure they can. Here we are leaving Deception Island through Neptune's bellows. Now, if you listen to the video, you can hear the wind blowing pretty hard. This is referred to as Neptune's breath. Now, it's more dramatic on the way in, and I was standing outside, and it just seemed really calm. As soon as we broke the point where we're at right now, all of a sudden that wind kicked up, and that's what they meant by Neptune's breath. And then our final stop was at Yankee Harbor. Again, more Gen 2s. And we did have a couple leopard seals and a sea lion. Here we are watching a mother feeding her chick. And watch how the baby penguin will sit there and peck at the beak. And the mother will get ready. Open up. And it's feeding time again. This is our crew and our expedition staff saying goodbye to us. This is our last look at the Ushuaia before we left. It was a great cruise. We had a great time and we enjoyed all of our activities. If you liked our video, please hit the like button. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe.